I'm Jake Goldberg. This is the sports update for Colonial Corner. We're here in Homedale Park in Homedale, New Jersey as the Morristown competes in the Meet of Champions. The, for the boys, we have the whole full team competing and then for the girls, Christina Kane is competing individually. The best result they had was in 1997 as they came in second for the boys. Now let's see how they do on the course. I'm here with Christina Kane. Christine, how do you feel about competing in the Meet of Champions? I feel really excited. It's such an honor to be here and we've all worked so hard and it's just really great to see all the hard work pay off today. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Thank you. I'm here with Coach Rooney. Some people call him Rune Dog, Big Rune. Coach Rooney, how do you think Christine's going to do today? She's going to run great. Uh, she's got a work ethic that's second to none and she's got a long history when there's a big race. She really steps up and I'm watching her warm up and she just looks really happy and really focused. And how's the Rune Dog Foundation? The Rune Dog Foundation right now has been depleted of funds, so kids, please study and remember me when you make millions of dollars on Wall Street. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I'm here with Christine's teammates. Girls, how do you think Christine's going to do? Excellent. She's going to kick butt. She's doing it. She's going to do great. She's going to do, I don't know. <laughs> she's going to break the record. Yeah. She's going to do really great. She'll PR. She'll do great. Well, thank you, ladies. Wait, give me that. Oh, she's going to take the bull, and she's going to ride that wave. You feel me? Christine, how do you think you did it today in the race? I think I did well. I didn't run my best time today. Uh, that was last week, but I felt really good on the race, and it's such a great honor to be here anyway, and I'm just really glad to be able to run today. And what are your thoughts on the season as a whole? As a whole, I'm just so proud of all the girls. It's just been a great year, such a nice team, and we've all worked really hard, and we're looking forward to next year. I'm here with Mr. Lyons and Mr. Torres. Thoughts on the race? Uh, we're gonna get, we're gonna run our hearts out. Our goal is to go top six. Um, all of us, we're gonna stay compressed. Uh, we're gonna try hard. And Sean here. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna try to go out with the rest of the team and, and go ahead and uh, I want to get the school record today for the course. But we're just gonna run as hard as we can, and we're gonna trust our training for the season and hopefully get top six and get on the podium today. I'm here with the super sophomores at the Varsity Seven. Mr. Edwards, Mr. Quinn, how are you guys going to do in today's race? Uh, I'm trying to PR today. Uh, hopefully our team can get the top six. That's our goal of the day. And I'm feeling excited. Our team looks ready to go, and we're going to do good. Yeah, I'm excited to be yeah, to be part of this team. I know Ben's going to be going out hard today, so I want to I want to be right there with him, right there with my whole team right at the end, across the finish line. Hopefully we'll get the W. Mr. Veloci, how are you going to do today in the meet of champions? We're going to go get them. We're going to take it to the to the other teams out there, we're going to show Morristown. What we're we're going to show everybody what we're made of here at Morristown. <laughs> and as always, I hope you get a PR. Oh, thank you, Greg. That's very kind of you. I'm here with the Mustache Brothers on the cross country team, Mr. Pitt and Mr. Arabasian. Boys, how are you going to do today in the race? Uh, hopefully, our mustaches will carry us over the hills, back down the hill, and then back up the hill, and then down the hill once again, completing the entire course quickly. Agreed. Our mustaches will carry us to victory. Gina, this is the big one. You call it the show. What's your message to the team right before the race? Well, I hope the team shares the same uh, passion that we all do. We, uh, we love the uh, cross-country season, and, and this is the ultimate race, Jake. And uh, I hope the guys can, can do very, very well and um, enjoy the day. And be great. Be something if we finish amongst the top ten and, and maybe even higher. Um, they got a great day for it, Jake. It's just amazing out. The wind is kind of a, a mild, mild breeze and uh, temperatures high, high 40s, almost 50. So it should be a good day. Really excited for the guys today. I think they're going to do very, very well. That's it, Morris Town. Bring it. Bring it today, baby. Bring it today, Morris Town. That's it, Morris Town. Bring it. Oh. Good job, Rudy. Stay up. boy. Stay together, baby. Stay together, Morristown. Stay together. That's it, Greg. Confidence, Greg. Confidence. Up the hill. Up the hill. And we beat yourself.
Believe in yourself! Believe in the Christ! Oh, 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 Mr. Edwards, you got a PR in this race. How do you feel about the, your PR and the race overall? Uh, I'm pretty happy with PR. Most importantly, it's about the team. We, uh, we're, we're aiming for top six. Had a pretty good day. We got eighth, so I mean, that's, that's awesome. I'm on the ground here with Mr. Torres. Rudy, how do you think you did on the race? Uh, first half of the race, I felt really good. Uh, uh, there was a little mishap on one of the routes. Kind of hit it. It might hurt my ankle, but I fought through. Felt like I had a very... Very gutsy race today. Sean, you came in first for the Colonials. Uh, you guys came in eighth. How do you think you did overall and the team did overall? Uh, I think we did well as a team. Um, we did a little bit, not as well as we had hoped to. Um, we wanted to make the podium. We were two places behind. Uh, we were only back by about 20 points, which in a meet like this is not very much. Uh, so, you know, we had a strong performance overall. Um, and I'm happy with how I did. I was a few seconds off the school record, but um, it was a fast time. So. You know, I'm pretty happy with what we did today. Mr. Quinn, you, you came in second for the Colonials. How do you think you did today? Uh, I felt pretty good. It was kind of cold, so I mean, I was chilly on the starting line, but uh, I warmed up pretty quickly, and I thought I raced well today. Mr. Veloce, I wish you a PR. You got a PR. Thoughts on the race? Uh, you know, I thought we did great. I'm really proud of the guys, really proud of Gav. Thank you. I'm proud of Sean. Did a, did a great job. Um, it's been a great season, and I love these guys. So, I yeah. I love you too, John. How about you, Mr. Pitt? What are your thoughts on the race? Uh, I think we all did pretty well. Sean Lyons especially. Shout out to the homie. 1610. Very, very fast. Uh, I ran near my PR, which is good. John PR, 10 seconds. You know, almost all of us did very well today. Coach Gino, you guys came in top 10, finishing 8th overall. What are your thoughts on today's race? Well, Jake, I'm really thrilled. Happy for the guys. It was great to come in the top 10, and coming in 8th was just a a little a little bit better than um, you know than we had thought we were hoping uh, that we would be able to slide into the top 10 because we were 10th coming in and then coming in eighth and only being within 20 seconds of the top six in the podium I think is uh, really a blessing so we're, we're very excited very pleased and uh, thrilled for all the guys the way we finished strong there you have it Marstown Christino King ran a phenomenal race and the Marstown boys finished eighth overall coming in the top 10 in the first time in over 10 years well, I want to thank the Morristown Cross Country team for inviting me out here and Brian Pizzuti for being on camera. We wish them the, re we wish them the best of luck at regionals. This is Colonial Corner with Gavin Pitt. <laughs> thank you.